Welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can make a platformer game. So, I created this platformer game, let's say, a long time ago now. But my camera will be a little bit laggy, but I think that it's completely fine. I think it will be better. Now, uh, let's make our project. So, right over here, this is our like, new project. I'm just gonna name this platformers so I don't accidentally delete it. There we go. Then after that, I will create a new sprite. This sprite will name, I'll name it there. I level. We're just gonna name the costume by number. So if this level is level one, it will be. Level and will be number one. Yeah. That's it. So yeah. After that let's create a simple level. A few moments later. Alright guys, I finished with the like my first level now. Make sure the position of the X is zero and also the Y. So, so right now it's in the center. This is gonna make a. This is gonna make a sprite. I'm just gonna make all, all the sprites. I'm just gonna create like a simple like block sprite. Hold on. Okay. Okay, now we got our uh, sprite right now. We're just gonna name this sprite right here. Now let's make this sprite script right now. I mean, the level. When you just right click, show. Oh, I'm downloading from Show and. Over here, forever. We're just gonna go ahead over here. Switch costume to. We're just gonna make the variable call level. Show level. We're just gonna set the level to one first. Then we're just gonna hide this variable. So we're done with the level script. This is all the level script right now. I'm gonna look for now. Let's go to player script. So make a variable. Make sure it's for the sprite on the sprite only. Name it X velocity. And name it another one. I mean like create another one called Y velocity. There we go. Now we got two of these variables. So right now let's make a let's make a Moving script right now. So, we're just gonna s s set a position for for our sprite to start. Then let's make a condition if it's gonna make if two of these if it's just gonna put it forever. After that, if key, right arrow press and key left arrow press over here. Change, this is gonna change x velocity. There we go. After that, uh, if, if you press, it's just gonna change. There we go. 
then let's go ahead and make this right move. So yeah, I'm just gonna set it's just gonna change x by x velocity. But the thing that is happen if it just like move forever until it being zero and something like that. But there's like the way how can you fix this? For set sets x velocity to uh x velocity times 0 0.9 let's see once again so right now it's moving like slowly and smooth right now uh i was let's say oh uh, sprite can still pass the level let's just fix that so first let's go ahead and make this right I mean, this could, sorry. It's gonna say touching level motion with motions change y by one. We're just gonna duplicate this six time. Okay, one, two, three, four. Wait, hold on. Or there, five and six. So the six one, change it to minus five. Change x by uh, x velocity multiply by minus one. Oops. Then put it over here. So after that, uh. It can't pass anymore. So what does this script do? Is it would change like y by one all the time, and then it would just like go something like this. It would just like meet the gravity, and it was just like change x velocity. Wait, wait let's say I'm just gonna say multiply here by minus one, so it can pass. Okay, let's make a gravity script. So to make a gravity script, you're just going to need, uh, now we do anything all about y velocity now. Just going to do this and change y velocity by y velocity. But right now we can't only have the, only that script because right now it's just broken. It just passed through these. So we're just going to fix it. To fix it, if then touching level and then go to motion and change y by this one in here and then set x velocity to zero after that it's just like a fly up and then if it's touching level uh, it will like it was just like being something like this. So now it's just like normal now, but we can't jump right now. I just try to press up. Oh, well, then let's make a jump script. So first, let's make a jump script over here. Up arrow press change y velocity to 14. But right now it's just like flying. I mean, I call it flying because if you hold, it's still flying. So, yeah, we're just gonna fix this a little bit. Yeah. To fix this, it's easy. Just put in our if, cover this in, and make it. Only touching the level, and right now, as you can see, it worked. The other thing is, right now, if you just like touch the corner, it just like falls down all the time. Touch the corner, it just like falls down all the time. So, 
Yeah, we just need to fix that. To fix this, put it over here. There we go. And then now you have it. It's not fall down anymore. So right now we're just gonna make a wall jump right now because we can't just wall jump if you don't have wall jump script. So go on the top over here and add this spread over here. I mean add the script. And then if then if up arrow press. There we go. Let's go ahead and change X velocity. Right, minus five and else change X. Oh, wait, hold on. Change five. After that, we're just gonna put in here. We're just gonna put sets Y velocity by ten. And then set X velocity to zero. So after that, you get this. So now there you have it, the wall. Let's say the wall jump. So that's it for the video. Make sure to like this video, subscribe. Make sure to turn on notifications, and don't forget to join my Discord server. If you have any questions, uh, you just find a Let's say it's a channel, a chat channel called Question Room, and I will answer all of your questions if you have any questions. So that's another video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.